So uh, we're continuing our study on giving. So uh, we may be feeling really frustrated because you're giving, you are focused, your heart is aligned with giving, but yet your finances are still out of control. You are still believing God for a breakthrough on the big bills that need to be paid and nothing is happening. You're getting so frustrated. You are full of anxiety. You're angry. And are you really, really believing that this whole faith and giving thing is real? Just hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Do not give up. This is the time now to even go deeper deeper, deeper into the believing that your giving is working because all of it is a test to distract you from pursuing forward, from continuing in your faith in the giving. The devil doesn't want you to progress. He is going to try to throw everything and anything at you to make you doubt, doubt God, doubt his love for you, doubt that any of it works. But it does. Trust me. I have been through it. And when I have been feeling uh, frustrated or angry and then even doubt comes in and I regret it and I repent of it, but doubt does come in, I recognize that I have to get into the word. I have to do other things to get my belief, get build up my faith so I can continue to press forward because once the devil has you, it's not going to get any better. He may trick you to believe that it's going to get better, that it's better doing it the world's way, that it's better to do it in the concept that you're thinking of. The only solution, the best solution, the holistic, real solution, the solution that only will look out for you is through God, through the Word of God, through the principles that God has prepared for us. So we got to trust and believe that God has our best interests. So when we are working, working the word, saying the word, praying, giving, we are fighting, fighting through behind the scenes, behind the spiritual warfare, so we can be prosperous, we can be healthy, we can have a sound mind, we can have favor, we can have opportunities that we, we couldn't even done on our own. And that's all through giving. It's all through obedience. It's all through patience and being steadfast and pressing forward. So when you're feeling frustrated, step back. Get into the Word of God. Put some praise and worship music on. Get around other believers that will encourage your faith. But stay encouraged. Stay encouraged. Fight against the frustration. 